feed there, we'll just pass on by. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're welcome on my roads anytime. <laughs> Voila, it is wet, cold, and uh, we've still got 80 k's to go on our planned route today. Um, and 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 the view would have been sensational up here, I'm sure, from the little scrapings of uh, what we can see. Um, if the weather was fine, it would have been beautiful. But uh, unfortunately, we can see just past the end of the <laughs> just past the end of our nose. Uh, these clouds are quite thick at the moment. So you've got to crack the visor open to stop them from uh, fogging up and in doing so you're letting all the rain in. <laughs> yeah, bit of a bummer. Never mind. This is our first wet day for a while now. Uh, we've always been under the threat of rain. Well, it's caught us today. Yeah. Yeah, I can see. Uh, people have got their fires going and of course that sets your mind sets your mind off to I'd love to be sitting in front of one with a, a nice whiskey or something at the moment. <laughs> but anyway. That's what makes it an adventure. Okay. Uh, we've come down just a little bit. Uh, now the, the clouds thinned out somewhat. Oh, as I say that, we turn the corner and there's another cloud we're just going into. Yeah, but uh, we could see we could see a bit. Someone's been up here building walls, that's for sure. Yeah. Yeah, it's massive. there. coming up. Uh, look, uh, look at that, you know, they've built a bloody wall around up this hill, all over the place. 
Yeah. so I could see and <laughs> my nose is running now. <laughs> oh. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I'll scare him off. <sighs> Give Nancy a bit of a growl. Oh look at you. No, don't do that. Don't do that. You'll slip and hurt yourself. Fucker. I'm ready to give it the juice uh, and get past them. Slow down. There you go. Ring your bell, it's all right. Do you want to go this, oh, this is an interesting switchback. Looks like a skate ramp. Yeah, oh, it's steep, I'll say that. That won't show up in the camera, but it is very steep. A lot of moss on the concrete too. Yeah. Road's very wide. <laughs> Room for a car and about half a bike. Uh, oop, here we go again. Holy crap, that's steep. <laughs> yeah, there won't be it won't be seeing too many mammals on this road. That's for sure. Yep. No. <laughs> well, not on that mountain range, anyway. We are. On our approach to uh, uh, what is it, the uh, Cursa de Alice, uh, seaside port or marina in uh, Spain, right up the north, and this is kind of like the entrance road to Cursa de Alice. Uh, we're only 16 kilometres from where we're going to be, but. Um, it's a shame the roads are wet because I don't have a great deal of confidence in the wet, but uh, the road's brilliant. Uh, a lot of gum trees here too, which is quite surprising. Just waiting for a drop bear to come out and get us. But uh, yeah, the roads are really nice. We'll be ready for that uh, end of day beer. As we, we've got to try and find somewhere to stay yet, we haven't done any of that. So we'll pull up, find a pub. Bar Restaurante or something like that and uh, we'll have a beer while we look for somewhere to stay. Okay, two minutes after the last little bit of video we come over the crest of the mountain range and a beautiful view off into the ocean uh, and I'm guessing uh, uh, the town where we were heading to. Um, really really nice.
and I think the sunshine came out just for that little bit of film because <laughs> there's nothing but clouds up above us now uh, so anyhow uh, that'll do for today I guess unless you want to just have a little bit of time on the bike Planted by the look of it after being harvested. Yeah, some poor guys are inside the fence, and others have made a run for it. <laughs> yeah. On ya, fellas. That's the way. <laughs> making out like I pick narrow winding roads on purpose. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, we just left Castro Urdiales. We're heading... Uh, where are we heading? North. Or north east. And... Uh, heading over uh, the freeway for a while just to uh, make a few kilometres because we are expecting rain, probably lots of it and uh, yeah, that's about it for the morning and we last little bits of Spain to endure today we may get through to the border but uh, with France not sure but uh, beautiful little bit of forests uh, just above uh, a town called Leeds uh, just giving a little bit of a tidy up just in case it was quite visible was it that uh, yeah, yeah. Mookie yeah okay anyhow uh, we're uh, uh, yeah, I'll uh, back again. Um, just uh, we've done a morning of uh, highway, and now we're back on what was the original. Uh, yeah, Greg's Gate Track, um, and the roads are fairly wet, but we haven't been saturated just yet. But it'll probably happen. Um, and there's a, you know, in the forest like this, there's a fair bit of moss on the road. Hard to see on camera, um, but yeah, it's very slippery. So just taking it nice and easy as we wind our way down. And we don't know where we're going to stay because we made it to the place we were going to stay, and it's still fairly early. So we'll make hay while the sun may shine. Uh, but oh, hello. Someone's outside of the fence. Grass is much greener out here, mate. Yeah. We have just left Elizonda. And we're back onto the goat track, and uh, we're heading up the hill um, towards France today. There's no doubt we will cross the border, um, as long as no cows knock us off the edge of the road here. Oop, bit of dung. And uh, yeah, the weather has subsided somewhat. We are in the wet weather gear, expecting a bit of a bit of rain today, and we're going back this way, not onwards. Um, yeah, everything's uh, looking good. We've got a little bit of a patchy sky. 
had a nice caffeine hit this morning before we left the hotel and uh, ready to push on let's hope it's a good day yeah hello boys and girls <laughs> quaint Now, this is why we like going on the back road. It's just a little bit of different uh, scenery and... Uh, oh wow, that looks really nice down there. Beautiful valley. And uh, good morning to you two guys. Ah, oh, shame, you got the bell. <laughs> the bell of shame. Ah, <laughs> uh, there. We've got a few in the forest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These bloody European hikers, they love it. They just love it. We must be getting near the top of this hill. It's quite quite high above the valley where we came from. We came from the very bottom. And that was at about 180 metres above sea level. Yeah, a couple of uh, birds of prey up above. Yeah, a few of them up there. Um, yeah, we're now at 530 metres, so we've come up about 300. <coughs> and still going. The roads are very wet as of due to all the rain we had. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is a back road, that's for sure. Um, but it is in brilliant condition. Nice surface. Only a couple of cracks here and there. Gee, that's stunning. That view. Ah, uh, yeah. Some unfriendly clouds over there. I'm guessing. If, if you've got boobies, you can only do 50. Yeah. A little bit more forest on our run down the hill. Well, from the last bit of video, it's probably been down the hill, up the hill, down the hill, and back up the hill. Now we're going down. It's looking a little bit grim in the distance. Quite dark over there, and it's going to get very dark around this corner, I should imagine. Looks like we're going under the trees. Yep. It's. <laughs> yeah gather what the tr what the tracks like at the moment and uh, uh, we just went past the sign warning uh, two kilometers of winding road <laughs> we haven't seen a straight road yet so I don't know why the need for the sign anyhow they probably get paid to put some signs up so they go and do it yeah, here, comes, here comes the rain the uh, helmets giving us that ting 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 sound as the raindrops hit anyway here we go looks like it'll be a little bit thick yeah yeah so the rain came through last night and this morning and we kind of left in somewhat patchy fine weather but uh, maybe we've caught up with the rain not too sure which way the clouds are going where we are anyhow adios